Why are you doing this to us? Are you insane? How could you do that? Oh. My. God. I found you in my bed. How'd you wind up there? You are a mystery. Little black curly hair. Little black curly hair. Little black, little black, little black, little black, little black curly hair. And I felt it. How did it feel? You feel alive. Ooh, I'm alive with pleasure now. I'm gonna kiss you in about ten seconds, and if you don't want me to kiss you... Well, if you don't want me to, I guess then you're just gonna have to stop me. count to five. One, two, three. Damn it! I have to be pretty freaking stupid not to know, right? That the two people I trusted most in the world are lying to me? So are you, are you bored, are you confused, or just malicious? Hey, look, I started this thing, okay? If you're gonna get angry at somebody, you get angry at me. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> <laughs> if you two are happy, then I'm happy for you. I'm fine. Really? Absolutely. I'm fine. <laughs> totally fine. I, I don't know why it's coming out all loud and squeaky, because really, I'm fine. <laughs>
And yet I know if I stop eating this, I'll regret it. Dawson is the guy that you want to be with. Hang up! I want to be buried at sea. It looks like fun. Fish. Seaweed. A sunken ship. Things you find in the ocean. Dawson Leary would never have screwed up like I did, John. It just wouldn't have happened. You know that. Hang up! I found out yesterday that I'm fourth. My class rank. I'm fourth. I don't give a tiny rat's ass. I don't even know why I bother. I knew you wouldn't understand. So you never really had any desire to do great and heroic things with your life? See faraway places, uncover lost civilizations. When it comes right down to it, you'd be just as happy hanging out here in Cape Side. Look, I didn't say that. Don't put words in my mouth. Don't you put words in people's mouths. You put turkey in people's <laughs> mouths. You couldn't possibly have thought that you could solve all of your problems in one night with alcohol of all things. No. No. Because alcohol, you know, it has that effect on problems. It just never solves them. Ever. And I would hate to think that I fell in love with a moron. Damn! Drunken! Bitch! I say push it down the stairs. Push, push it down the stairs! Push it down the stairs! Just as long as you realize that if you do turn into some typical hormone-filled silly-ass boy and try to manipulate me again, I'm out the door. It's locked! What? what? Oh, sure, now they lock it. But when they're having sex on the couch, it's like, come on in, my butt is surprisingly hairy. Hey, guys. Look who's joining us. <laughs> All right. Miss Mobile is gassed and ready to go. Who's coming? Let's go, Pace. I know it's really shallow, but a part of me wants him again. <laughs> oh, well, get in line, Missy. <laughs> so can I have a ride, Stud? That tastes like feet. No one gives Pacey a break. Everybody expects the absolute worst out of Pacey. Pacey gets the short end of the stick. Pacey gets fireworks and an ashtray and chipped beef on toast for his birthday and endlessly harassed because how dare he want to go to college so he could possibly get out of this place. But you know what, Dad? You and your wallet can breathe easy because I don't think I could go to college even if I wanted to because I found out today that the only school I thought would take me, my fallback school, rejected me. So I'm not going to college. So I guess at the end of the day, you guys are right. I'm going to end up exactly where you thought I would. A complete and utter failure. See now, what I just heard? Blah, 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 blah. This is eight months and counting. So I just, I, I want, I need for you to know that if our relationship is not going to be progressing on to that next level, it, it's not because of me. So basically you're saying that if I don't sleep with you soon, we're going to break up and it's going to be all my fault? We are supposed to make these decisions together. Did you not watch the Dr. Phil I did? Sex. Tell me that we could laugh about sex now, because it seems to me that's the only rational thing to do. You know, you can't enshrine it. You can't run from it, because it's everywhere. It's like food and water and air. That's like the pervert motto. Times when you get older, when you'll want to sleep with people just to make them like you. But don't. Because <laughs> that's another thing. That you don't want to do. Everybody, that's, that's another thing that you don't want to.